Yes, guys, again, kamayas na naman yung presyo ng gasolina, ng diesel. So, para sa mga laundry owners, laundry business operators, and especially if we offer free pickup and delivery to our customers, which is a great convenience, you know, you pick up their dirty clothes and drop off their clean clothes right at their doorstep. Super convenient. But since the gas prices, diesel prices have gone up again, of course, malaki ang epekto nito sa ating kita. <laughs> All right. Aside from gas prices, we're also talking about yung paggamit natin ng LPG. Most of us, lonely business operators, may mga ano tayo, mayroon tayong dryer machine, drying machine, which uses LPG to produce heat and dry clothes faster for our customers. Others have electric uh, dryers and washer. But for those who uses uh, gabi, uh, syempre, nakita rin natin yung pagtaas ng rates, di ba? pagtaas ng presyo ng mga LPG. And that also contribute to also pagbawas ng ating kita sa pag-operate ng laundry business. So makikita natin yan. Compare natin yan sa ibang months, ibang years. Now, it's just super high. Really, really high. Ano pa guys, aside from gas prices, of course, the water. Uh, medyo tumayas na rin talaga yung konsumo. Uh, since bumabalik na rin naman yung dami ng tao nagpapalaba, uh, I'm assuming tumataas na rin konsumo mo sa laundry shop mo. But ang difference is from the previous years, mas mataas naman yung rate na singil ng, kunyari, ng Manila or Manila Water. So, higher siya. Higher ang bills na dumadating sa ating mga laundry owners. So, gas, uh, water, also electric, uh, Siyempre, iba-iba yung setup natin for those uh, meron tayong air conditioning, meron tayong mga tinatawag na POS, gumagamit tayo ng computer dyan. Also, pag-operate ng internet natin, Wi-Fi. Uh, ano pa ba? Hmm. Ah, air conditioning. Uh, if your laundry shop has uh, air conditioning, so, depende na rin yan kung gaano ko Katagal mo ginagamit, if it's uh, 24 hours service, medyo malaki yung magiging electric bill mo. If not, kung gumagamit ka lang naman ng uh, electric fan, uh, medyo industrial, commercial size, and open yung, ano mo, open yung shop mo, meaning hindi siya enclosed na required yung uh, air conditioning. Medyo siguro nakakatipid tayo, pero... Of course, ramdam natin yan. Nararamdaman natin yung pagtaas ng electric bills din natin. Kasabay ng tubig, gas, LPG. And of course, recently in-announced din ng government na mandatory uh, minimum wage increase natin. So, tumaas din yan. Uh, medyo tumataas lahat ng bagay. Pero syempre, ang uh, gusto natin is also tumaas din ang sales lalim lalim na ang kita natin. Uh, yun, before ko makalimutan, of course, tumataas din yung mga bilihin. Meaning, sa sabon. Kung bili natin ng sabon na ginagamit sa paglaban ng mga damit. Also, yung mga plastic. Uh, depende na yan kung gamagamit tayo na uh, yung tinatawag na biodegradable na plastic. Oh, na naradamdam ko yung pagtaas sa price na yan. Also, meron tayong mga laundry bag. Uh, may kanya-kanya na tayong supplier. So, siyempre, mga supplier din natin, may kanya-kanya na expenses. And uh, siguro, nagtaas na rin sila yung presyo. Depende rin sa situation nila. Pero the summary, ang pinaka-bottom line natin, guys, is 
lahat na lang ay tumataas sa gastos side. So, ang pangarap natin ngayon is, gusto natin ma- magawa ng solution is, patasin din natin yung sales natin. So, ano ba yung mga paraan or ways for us laundry owners to also increase our sales during this time of high inflation? Kung baga, sa pagtaas ng mga gastusin, di ba? Na mga binanggit ko earlier, paano natin mapapatas din ang kita natin sa laundry business? So, ako personally, unang-una, really emphasize the value na quality, di ba? Sa mga empleyado natin, of course, uh, customers natin, kailangan natin ipalam sa kanila, also let them experience what quality is. Kasi, ito to lang naman, uh, anybody can buy their own washing machine and do their own laundry or wash their own clothes. Or, second, they can also hire their own house helper or sama sa bahay and ask them to do their laundry for them. Uh, pero they choose to come to our laundry shop for convenience, for siguro to save time and also save money. But what would really make them come back and excited to even tell their friends or family to bring their clothes to your shop is the experience you know, na you gave them a quality service. Una una, when they talk to you personally, they visit their store, uh, quality by yung tao. Ibig sabihin, pagdating ng tao, your employees greet them, may smile, kahit na face mask, and they're excited to see or greet your customers. Yun, kung physically, they bring their clothes or kung self-service yan, uh, makita ba nilang malinis yung lugar mo and when they use your machines quality ba? Ibig sabihin talagang nalilinis yung damit nila once they use the, your machines and they don't spend a lot of time there kumbaga if 30 minutes maximum 2 hours they're able to finish all their washing so meaning talagang they were able to save time and money going to your shop uh, I would assume na talagang that would be, bring, give them a sense of uy, quality dito, yung machine dito, maganda, talagang gumagana lahat and what I pay for is quality. Uh, malilingis talaga and walang damage, di ba? Hindi na the damage yung damit ko pag ginamit yung machine dito. If you're in a full service naman, quality same, almost the same. Kung kayo yung mga imply, empleyado mo yung gumagawa, uh, your attendance does the la- do the laundry for the customers. Same quality, di ba? Uh, kung, kung, kung paano nila dinala yung damit, kumpleto, maayos, walang mga stain, walang mga damage, butas, or nag-shrink yung damit, They'll remember that. They'll know, oh, dito, pinagpalaba ako, safe. Uh, sure ako, quality. No, na, yung damit ko, malininis na maayos. And when I come back, ready na yan para sa akin, na, sotin ko na yan. Wala na akong iba pang iisipin pa. And, they know na, uh, dito hinahalo sa ibang mga damit na ibang customers. Minsan kasi, ginagawa yun ng iba. Uh, hindi lang din natin alam. Depende siguro kung sinisipag yung mga tao natin or gusto lang din natin makatipid sa, yun nga, sa bills. Pero, of course, the best way is to just one load per customer. Uh, 